Quick disclaimer, now this was supposed to be completely in 4K, I think I messed something up, I'm not sure what I did, but I think it was uh, changing some settings in the DJI Osmo app, and not all of it was in 4K, so I've uploaded it all in 1080p. Now back to the good stuff. Alright, so i um, using the Osmo 2 now, just finished shooting at the first location, gonna make my way to the second location, I actually need to charge this then. So I haven't charged it, it came with about 18% battery, so I uh, was trying to connect it up and stuff. So uh, yeah, it's actually pretty good. You can see it's pretty smooth. Uh, I'm going to compare it and I'm going to do some footage uh, without the gimbal. Uh, I'm actually vlogging on my phone, so the whole vlog is going to be on in 4K, 30 frames. So uh, yeah, let's see how it goes. Uh, because Canon thinks it's okay to have oversized 4K files and, uh, you know, that kind of palaver. And uh, I don't really want to be carrying a 5D Mark IV because the G7X Mark II doesn't do 4K. Canon, Canon needs to catch up. They need to catch up fast. Okay, so this is what it looks like. It's all shaky. I'm trying to keep it still as possible. Proper shaky. So yeah, three, two, one. Get set the gimbal on. Um, now this is using the gimbal. You can see, nice and smooth. Not like before, just tilt that down a little bit, yeah, so it's nice and smooth, makes a big difference. And yeah, let's, uh, it's almost time for the sunset, you can see that, you see that? Let's just adjust the camera, there you go. So, there you go, so you can just see, almost sunset time, and get a nice sunset shot somewhere down there. And yeah, let's see how that goes. So I'm just getting to a location now. Um, I, I did record earlier, but for some reason, um, the DJI app's not letting me record in 4K anymore. Don't know why, uh, it worked earlier. Uh, but the option's gone completely. So uh, just re-recording. Uh, you can see it's nice and smooth. Um, came with about 18% uh, battery charge. And this is kind of like my first gimbal. So uh, I'm quite impressed with it. Uh, I can't really compare it to the first one, but uh, I'm not complaining uh, and yeah, let's just check out the view over here Ooh, Just tilt that up Whee! There you go Canary Wolf Okay, so what I'm gonna do now, I've uh, just got some more shots so what I'm going to do now is, now this is the iPhone, I'm using my iPhone to vlog by the way. So, um, well obviously it's the Osmo Mobile, right? So um, what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you front facing. So this is, well no, back facing, back facing camera. So we're going to look the other way. Three, two. stable and then we change okay so we're facing me again now this camera comes in walk mode and sport mode so if I start doing this you can see it's pretty good but then you have sport mode but I can't show you sport mode because it doesn't do 4k Oh, it's supposed to do 4K. I don't know why it's not letting me do it. So, sorry guys, I, I can't show you sport mode at the moment. But look, check this out. Also, another cool feature. Whoa, getting all dark. So, also another good feature of this is it has life lapse, time lapse, um, panoramic. You can also take, a, keep it still and take a um, what you call it, long exposure. So, yeah, overall uh, pretty good. Uh, it's just uh, yeah, I've got, I'm enjoying it. It's nice. Pretty smooth, look. No shaky shaky. Gives me more freedom. I can now have stable, like proper stable video without having to take out the G7X. Um, and I can obviously vlog in 4K now because my iPhone 8 does 4K video. And this is too big to lug around and the G7X doesn't do that. So yeah, advantage DJI. <laughs> Got some 
good b-roll footage so this is me using the phone uh well vlogging without a gimbal and uh, which is right here so you can see it's quite shaky so what i'm gonna do now again is switch back to the gimbal see how that works out all right so just got a long exposure some light trails of bus so that was around st paul's which is just up there uh how do i do this yeah st paul's so just getting some b-roll still vlogging on the iphone pretty good i'd say for night time still pretty clear not much noise can you see me yes you can all right let's get some more b-roll So yeah, just uh, finished up on a long exposure, got some light trails of a London bus and that noise you can hear is of a water fountain over there, got some b-roll and yeah overall I think it's a pretty good gimbal, you know you can take some good shots uh, in landscape mode, in portrait mode, you can actually switch it into portrait mode or you can just go sideways just to adjust it quickly. Um, I am really impressed with it with a with a steady shot and also I'd say you can take shots from down below so you can turn it upside down and get some good shots like let's say on a skateboard or something like that um, or a, you know a walking perspective from down below depends on what angle you want what kind of shots you want so yeah pretty useful pretty nimble uh, and I'm really impressed with it but obviously I don't have anything to compare it to but I'm gonna be doing a few more videos and um, I would like to say about the battery life so it came with about 18 percent and in the in the box and oh just adjust that sorry because i'm moving around and i'm just adjusting it um so it came with about 18 percent and i think it's on about 10 percent right now um the other thing is i did charge it uh, in between train stops on the way to the different places I've been today so I've probably charged it overall for about 10-15 minutes so yeah pretty good battery life so yeah I'd say uh, that's my unboxing and first review for the Osmo Mobile 2 so yeah love it so far over and up all right this is the London Underground test it's doing pretty well walking at a good pace it's freezing out there absolutely freezing yeah Gonna catch the train, excuse me there. So yeah, pretty steady. Pretty steady. Alright, this is the stairs case test. Alright, we're gonna run. Just wait for someone to move out of the way. Let's check it out, let's go. Yeah, did pretty well. Did pretty well. Let's say nine out.